The UFO in question was a high-pressure NASA balloon carrying a cosmic ray detector. Now, the unique... Coincidence in us finding this object at the autumnal equinox is that Dr. Frank Oppenheimer pioneered research on cosmic ray detectors. In fact, here's a picture of Frank and fellow physicists pioneering devices for investigating cosmic rays at Los Alamos. And these detectors were born aloft by weather balloons. There's an A-bomb right there. Just carrying it in his hand with the smoke in his mouth. So Frank Oppenheimer pioneered the research to detect cosmic rays. And this happened after the war. Frank returned to Berkeley for a time and then in 1947 went to the University of Minnesota where he undertook research that proved to be landmark in the development of cosmic ray physics. At this time, there was still no firm knowledge of the nature or origin of these rays. The mean value of their upwardly skewed energy distribution was greater by a factor of a thousand than the greatest cyclotronic energies, and no known astronomical processes could produce such energies. So serendipitously, <laughs> the Oppenheimer Ranch Project was out witnessing Oppenheimer's discoveries back in the late 40s, early 50s, pioneered at Los Alamos and continuing to be implemented today as cosmic rays increase to a new modern maximum and humanity enters a new realm which we need to understand.